If you need to design a certificate and don't have the time or the money to have one created, you can do this in Google Docs. Not only is it a free alternative to Microsoft Word, it also allows you to design and create a number of projects such as making a certificate. To get started, open Google Docs and start a new blank document. And then change the orientation of the certificate to landscape to give it the feel of the real certificate. You can do this by selecting the file tab and then select page setup. Change the orientation from portrait to landscape but feel free to play around the different size and page colors that suit your needs. In this case, we'll change the margin to 0.5 inches. After that, create a border for the certificate and although there is no option to add in a border in Google Docs, one simple way to create your own border is to do it using a table. You can do this by going to the Insert tab and then select Table. Make a 1x1 one -one table. Adjust the size of the table by dragging the lines of the table down to fill the whole page. You can also change the color and the style of it. The next thing to do is add in your text as the font you chose is going to set the tone for your certificate. You can choose the format and the layout of your certificate, but here we would format the text in the center of the document and just down four lines so the text is not right at the top of the page. The first line is usually used to acknowledge what the certificate is for, but in this case, this will be Certificate of Appreciation. Feel free to use whatever font, color, and size you wish for this. The next few lines of your certificate shall state the certificate is being awarded or acknowledge the completion of a project or class and who is it being awarded to. Then add in a blank line for the signatures. A signature is one of the most important aspects of a certificate. Not only does the signature acknowledge the award, it also certifies it. And to create your signature line, go to the Insert tab and then select Drawing. Once the Draw tool is open, select the Line tool to create a horizontal line. And once you have adjusted the size of your lines you're liking, create a text box position underneath the line. You can use this text box to list the title of the person signing it or use it as a printed version of the name. The last step is optional, but you can add the seal of approval by going to the Insert tab and then select your picture with your seal. Now if you decide to add in your own picture border, fix first the page layout by going to the File tab again and then select Page Setup. Adjust all the margins to zero, and then change the orientation from portrait to landscape. Insert your border by going to the Insert tab again, and then select Image. Adjust the border to fill the page for your certificate, and choose Behind Text from the Layout options. And then type in your text by going to the Insert tab, and then select Drawing, and then select New. Create a text box in the Drawing tool, and then type in your text. Once finished, select Save and Close and adjust it on the certificate. Add in the signature line, the person signing it, as well as the seal of approval.
And if all of this looks a little plain for your liking, you can always look up for different templates available online. To do that, fire up your browser and then type in Certificate Templates for Google Docs. And this will show you a variety of options to choose from. And that's how you can create certificates using Google Docs. If you found this video helpful, kindly like and subscribe. You may also click and turn on the notification bell so you can be notified from whenever we release new videos.